Hello, people of the internet, my name is Johnny, and welcome to a very, very exciting quick FNAF news video. Steel Wool just revealed the free DLC coming to Security Breach in 2023, and it looks insane. If you're excited, please hit the like button. If you're new, subscribe, because we have a whole bunch of FNAF news to talk about. We cover FNAF news all the gosh dang time. So subscribing to this channel is the best way to guarantee you'll know exactly what's going on in the FNAF series. So like two minutes ago, by the time I'm recording this, Steer will tweet it out, returning guests will be granted free admission to the Pizzaplex. And attached is this picture. Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Ruin free DLC 2023. And it looks like this new character, this new little girl who I'm guessing will be the stand-in for Gregory, it looks like they're venturing into the, the newly destroyed Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizzaplex. Now I'm guessing that this practically confirms that the Afton ending is the canon ending to Security Breach. Because that's the only one that has like major damage to the Pizzaplex besides the, the fire escape ending, but this doesn't look like this doesn't look like a fire, this looks like it collapsed. Which is exactly what we see happening in the ending of the Afton, you know, the Afton ending. And you can see right here, a newly destroyed Glamrock Chica. We had shattered Chica, but she, this new Chica is extra, extra shattered. But that's super interesting because this confirms they're still gonna be alive, you know, they're gonna be in this DLC. Even though we destroyed them and the building collapsed on them, it looks like the Glamrock animatronics will still be in this new DLC. Now, I'm assuming that this little girl is just a completely brand new character, kind of like how Gregory was. Uh, I'm assuming this isn't, you know, like, obviously this isn't gonna be freaking Elizabeth or someone we know. I think it's just straight up a brand new character. Um, but yeah, up at the top, let's focus on this now. So Gregory is in distress, it looks like, right? Obviously, he's across all the monitors. He, you know, it says, help me. He's, you know, desperately looking at his Faz watch, looking around. He's in trouble, and I think this new little girl, the person who we're going to be playing as in the DLC, is going after Gregory to help him escape the ruined Pizzaplex. Now, what's interesting is that this is obviously a uh, sequel, if you will, a continuation of what we played. And if this DLC is the same DLC that we've been teased with um, the Chowder, Chica Chowder, it seems that we're still gonna have new attractions because, you know, Chica Chowder is completely brand new. It's a brand new attraction. It has the same, you know, poster style as all the other attractions in the Pizzaplex. It's a new, you know, it's a new attraction, but why would there be a new attraction in a place that very obviously is in ruins? It's so destroyed and ruined, in fact, that that's the name of the goddamn DLC. So why is there, why is there a brand new attraction? What's going on? I, I'm thinking maybe there's more to, there's more to this DLC than just the Pizzaplex being destroyed. It could be a whole bunch of things. Maybe there's flashbacks to when it was in a earlier state and there's Chica Chowder. Maybe we'll see it fixed over time at the very end of the DLC. It'll be all repaired, new attractions, yada yada. So while obviously this is a continuation of the story, you know, it's not a prequel. We're not going to see Glamrock Bonnie apparently, um, which I know was probably going to upset a lot of people. It's still interesting to, to theorize, are we still going to see it get repaired over time? Or are we just going to go in, get Gregory, get out? But here's the thing that, that gets me concerned, right? We see Gregory, we see Gregory, we don't see Glamrock Freddy. And if this really does happen at the end of the Afton ending where the whole Pizzaplex, you know, falls apart, we did escape with Glamrock Freddy, but we don't see him anywhere. Yet we still see, you know, Glamrock Chica. So if Chica's still in here, we can assume that all the other glam rocks are going to be as well, Roxy, Monty. But where's Freddy? Surely he's still, surely he's still going to be here, right? And if we're going in as this little girl, and and that's it, who's going to be our companion? Are we going to find Freddy first, and then we have to, you know, explore and look around for Gregory with Freddy as this little girl? Are we going to see Vanessa? Are we going to see some of the other characters like DJ Music Man? You know, the daycare attendant, Sun and Moon. Uh, who else? Who else? The little teeny Music Man with the symbols, the staff bots. Who's going to be in the DLC? Is Afton still here? The Blob? We saw the Blob take up Afton in the final cutscene of that, of that Afton fight. 
but are they still alive? Did they survive the ruining of the Pizzaplex? It also looks like there are doors, like garage doors instead of the elevators in the main lobby, which could be an oversight, since I'm pretty sure there were supposed to be doors instead of elevators uh, in earlier builds of the game. So they could have just made this before they added in the elevators instead. But it's just, it's so, so interesting. It's so interesting. I honestly didn't think we would get a, a poster this soon, but I will say I, I'm interested by this, by this girl. Because if she is a brand new character, why is she coming to the Pizzaplex? You know, where, where are her parents? We know Gregory doesn't have any, but what if she does? Does she have any connections to Gregory? Maybe they're siblings, you know, maybe they're just friends. I don't know. Like, why, why is this girl going into a ruined Pizzaplex just to look for... Gregory. Like, it doesn't make any sense. And how is Chica still alive? How is everyone else still alive? I mean, look at the- look at the state of the statue of Freddy. It's completely destroyed. And I will say, just massive props to Steel Wolf for the free DLC. I mean, that's- that's insane. We knew there was DLC coming. Everyone was kind of shaky, like, oh, they released the game in the state it was, and now they're making DLC. But I think the fact that it's free, and the fact that we've been getting, you know, consistent updates. I didn't talk about it in my previous FNAF news video, but there is currently an update releasing on consoles and hopefully PC pretty soon. But it's just, oh man, it's absolutely insane. I cannot wait. Honestly, cannot wait. I freaking loved playing Security Breach and this new take on it is going to be insane. There were so many people genuinely upset um, that the game was so colorful and bright and, you know, 80s aesthetic as it was, but now that we get this DLC, seeing the, seeing the destroyed state that Chica's in, seeing the, the state that the, the Pizzaplex is in, it gets me so hyped. Hopefully this is gonna be super horrific, super scary, ominous, because just imagine that, walking around the Pizzaplex destroyed in shambles. It's, I can't describe it. I'm so, so excited. But I think that's gonna do it. I'd love, love to hear your theories in the comments down below. What do you think is gonna be happening in this DLC? Obviously, we got a new character. Who do you think this is? What is her connection with Gregory? Why is she going into the Pizzaplex to get him? Obviously, he's alive. Do you think Freddy's alive? Do you think we're gonna see him at all? What are your thoughts on the Glamrocks coming back? I'm, I'm sure some people are kind of hoping for new characters, but it seems like it's just gonna be the Glamrocks again. Maybe there's a few surprises of new characters. I don't know. What are your hopes? What are your theories? What do you think's going on? 2023, that, that is a long ways away. You know, we're only going into, uh... God, what is next month? June? So we do have many months to wait, but hopefully, hopefully it'll be worth it because already this, this looks insane. So thank you guys so much for watching this FNAF news video on the brand new DLC of Security Breach coming next year, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.